Hey kids, welcome back. This is Homebrew Bruce. Uh, I haven't done anything for this channel in a long time because uh, I've been busy with my other channels. I do write music, I'm an artist as well. Um, I'm, I'll leave a link to my other channels below. But I think, in addition to beer, I think I'm gonna add another element to this channel. Um, well, I do, I, yeah, I, I did start on cigarettes when I was a teen. Then eventually I did move on to cigars and pipe tobacco. And now that um, cannabis is legal, you know, I kind of started back on that. I hadn't smoked that for a while, maybe in over 20 years or so. But yeah, I'm gonna add my tobacco thoughts to this channel. Um, I recently came across uh, a place called uh, Buffalo Dreams. Hopefully that comes out right. Uh, Buffalo Dreams are located in Tonawanda, New York. Buffalo, New York. Located on 900 Niagara Falls Boulevard. Okay. Probably, uh, I'll leave a link to that also below. But yeah, Buffalo Dreams. I picked up a couple of um, pre-rolled blunts there. Um, I got the Randy Marsh. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Yeah, I got the Randy Marsh, and I hope you know where that's referenced from, of course, South Park. And then I got something called Runt's Either, Either, Runt's Either, did a little, little research, it's like a mix of different things in there. Um, yeah, and let me see, each blunt cost, each pre-roll, um, half a gram cost 10 bucks for each, each uh, pre-roll. Yeah. So I so, uh, can't wait to try those anyway. Um, yeah, like I said to like I said before, I'm actually a cigar smoker and uh, pipe tobacco. Here, check this out. Alright, here's some of my pipes. This is an old one. Love this thing, uh, there's bamboo on there and everything. Corn pipe. A pipe that transforms into a um, spark plug. Here's one of my older pipes. It's pretty cool. A dolphin pipe. A dragon pipe. Uh, yeah, here's a couple of my tools that I use, regularly use. You know, the Chechen tool, pipe tools, sorted lighters. Uh, what else? But yeah, I don't keep too many cigars in the house anymore. It's mostly um, pipe tobacco that I keep. My latest ones are Warhorse Bar and uh, Cherry Ambrosia from uh, McBaron. And yeah, pretty cool stuff. But all right, at some point I'll probably go over this stuff, but I do want to do a review on these guys, like the blunts that are in here. Um, hold on, let me open up one and show you for a second. All right, here goes the... Uh... Runs either. Uh, flip top cap on that. So if I can open that easily. You gotta squeeze. It's like one of those weird pill bottles where you gotta squeeze the sides. Yeah. Who knows? Who knows? Alright, got it open. Alright, the half a gram. There you go. Ah, I missed that smell. But yeah, I'll try this outside later on or something when the weather gets better. All right, I'll see you kids later. All right, bye.